It's big, bold, strong and unique. The Essaya Gullis II is a prime research vessel from the word go. Its predecessor was built to be a cargo carrier and then adjusted for research. But the new vessel, at 134 meters, with eight permanent laboratories and six in containers, will give scientists an amplified opportunity to do their work. It's also a passenger ship and a cargo, bulk fuel and helicopter carrier. This is a very special ship, for, not only for South Africa, but also for the shipbuilder. It's a, it was quite a significant um, challenge. She's bigger than the current ship. Um, like I said, she will be a sophisticated scientific platform with a current ship has limited um, research capability. The ship is capable of breaking through one meter of ice. This means quicker access to the Arctic and will enable teams to stay longer. The Southern Ocean, which is on the doorstep of South Africa, um, is key to understanding climate change. And this ship will play a, a significant role in researching climate change, the climate change processes, etc. After sea and ice trials in Finland next year, Agulhas 2 sails to Cape Town on its maiden voyage and is scheduled to arrive in April. Mariska Boerta, SABC News, Cape Town.